what's coming? <laughs> she has bloody vegan, y'all. Okay, girl. Yes, y'all. I ain't never been a slutty vegan. I mean, I had it one time. Miles had brought me some home. But this is my first time, like, being in the store, and it's so cute. Mm. Oh, what's this? Oh, bacon. That's cool. Cool, cool, cool. Eat plants, bitch. Y'all, it do not gotta be this damn cold. Ugh, I'm so cold. But, and then today is the day that I chose not to wear a coat to work. All I have on is my little work vest. And this is not cutting it. But, Miles um, got me a black coat. Cause I know y'all see my purple coat, but he got me a black coat. It's long, like down to the waist. You see what I'm saying? Puffer for Christmas. But, I told him I wear a small, he got me an extra small. So I'm actually on my way to Dillard's right now on my lunch break to go exchange it. Oh yeah, I'ma probably definitely have to pay for parking because I can't parallel park. And that's all this is over here is parallel parking. I do not want to have to walk all the way. Damn, there's people behind me. I'm gonna go around. Cause I seen this lady finna get out of her parking space and I'm gonna see if I can get in. y'all so we're about to head out we're going to go um to the grocery store all right y'all so we're about to go to the grocery store can i prop you up can i prop you up hold on we're about to go to the grocery store. And then we're gonna go to Coop and Sean House to eat. I got my camera with me. Hopefully it don't die today. But I'm doing both on my camera and my phone because I don't know quite yet how to get the footage from my camera to my computer. So I'm recording on here as backup. Miles, we should take a picture today because we don't ever take any pictures together. My face looks clear. This is what I have on. This is what he has on. And he looking good with his haircut. Look at that head. Do y'all have any weird, like, like, for example, I love the shape of Miles' head. Like, how to explain it like a weird feature about your significant other that you like 
I like his head and I like his legs. Like his legs are just so sexy to me. Anyway, we'll call y'all back when we um yeah get to the spot. I need a shot of Hennessy. We left church. We went to church this morning, y'all. We had went to church and it felt so good to just like reset and recenter. I haven't been to church in a long time. I haven't been to church in so long, like it's been years since the last time I've been to church. Like I've watched church online, but like actually in church, it's probably been six years or something like that. It felt so good. I cried so much. I know Miles was probably like, girl, get yourself together. So yeah. so much about not having no friends and you know what I'm saying like just being so consumed in my family I'm so excited to be going out it's raining as you can see it's so disgusting outside my hair is not done it's just in a bun but I'm just still excited to be getting out and you know having some me time like we're going to the same spot that y'all always see me go to BBS um so yeah I'm so excited oh my god y'all i haven't been out in so long like by myself like just me and my friends every time i go out it's with miles and so like oh y'all i'm so excited but anyway um we're going out kind of early earlier than i'm used to i was like y'all want to meet at the spot at midnight they was like midnight i'm like yeah but anyway um so we're going a little bit early that's fine because like I said I'm gonna have time to like sit down and enjoy my food before it really get packed and like get up in there um so yeah I don't have on nothing but just all black you know I got on some boots like I said it's raining outside I got some new earrings from the beauty supply store and then I have to get up in the morning and go to work I have to be to work by 10 to is it 10? Yeah, I gotta be to work at 10 tomorrow. Oh, so that's not bad at all. Like, I can sleep in a little bit. And then, I don't have to worry about getting up in the middle of the night to see about no baby. Because I'm kid free. Like, y'all, uh, I'm finna have a ball. But, yeah, I'm gonna call y'all back when we get to the spot. Okay? Yo. Hey, y'all. Okay, girl. I know that's right. Are she vlogging me? Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> Say hey, Jabori. Right. Hey, y'all. Oh, look who we got. Okay. <laughs> okay. Dang, y'all, you ain't bring cups. No. Okay. Oh God. <laughs> that was a big shot. You can pass me a napkin right there. <laughs> yes, this is like. Um, he talking about where we at? Are we in Georgia? South, this South Atlanta. It's right past the airport. Okay, I did see the airport. Yeah, the okay. airport not close from here. Okay. <laughs> I was like, Don't act like you two boo to be <laughs> out here on Old National. But okay, y'all like, hear him acting like. <laughs> if you go like 85 South, you headed towards like Columbus area. Oh, that's down. That's where India come from. Mm -hmm. Damn. <laughs> she be driving. Oh, car. I'm done. <coughs> I'm done. Yeah, that'll do me. I'm reaching ready for waiting for the hookah. Yeah. Y'all, look at this. Good morning. Good morning. Explain yourself. <laughs> he brought the whole box from the house. All you had to do was put the cereal you in there. Do it too. Oh my God. What if I want more, more cereal? What am I gonna do? What else we got in here? Okay, birch and eucalyptus. All right, y'all. Today is Monday, January 23rd. Um, I just came on the camera real quick to let y'all know that we are on the way 
to Miles' procedure. I don't know if I told y'all. I probably didn't, but anyway, Miles is having a procedure today. Um, he is being put to sleep. So I'm a little worked up right now just because, like, you know, it's been a really stressful time for us. And on top of that, like, now he has to be put to sleep. And so, like, you know, I'm just a little worried, but I know God got us. And so he's right here. Y'all can see him. We um about to go to the place. I brought my laptop and everything because I have to stay there with him um, so that I can drive him when he's done. So Tristan has a basketball game. I mean, King has a basketball game today, so we're going to that later. So I'm sure I'll probably vlog some of that. I haven't seen the kids in a long time, and I really, really miss them. So, yeah, I'll keep y'all updated. All right, y'all, so Miles is in the back for his procedure, and I'm sitting in the car in an awkward position, as you can tell. But anyway, um, I just kind of wanted to talk to y'all. I have to sit here, and I can't go nowhere, so I'm like, this is the perfect time to say, you know what I'm saying, what's on my heart and stuff. So... I know in my last video I had been saying, well, I had said that I wanted to take some time away from YouTube, away from social media, just because I was so mentally and emotionally drained, physically, every way that you can think of, I've been drained. And um, I feel like ever since then, I think I, I said that on, what was that, New Year's Eve? Um, but ever since then, I've been getting what I would say, I guess, is a sign um, to keep vlogging, keep recording, and keep, you know, showing y'all, not everything, but, you know, like, just keep going, keep, you know, doing what I've been doing. Um, it is very hard to want to vlog and do stuff when you're, like, y'all, like i'm really 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 like going through it like and i hate to just say that because you know people say all the time like oh i'm depressed and da da da. but like no i'm just being honest and straightforward like this past these past couple weeks and really the past couple months but weeks especially have been a really really i feel like i got some on my face right here have been a really 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 dark time in my life like the darkest days of my life um so like it's hard during that time to just be like okay i'm gonna pick up my phone and record like half the time i don't even feel like doing it i don't feel like getting up i don't feel like nothing like i don't feel like putting myself together i don't feel like cleaning up like and depression shows itself differently so one way you may show your depression the other person is not going to show their depression the same way you know what i'm saying or like depression is not going to affect them the same way should i say so like i don't feel like cleaning my house i don't feel like getting out the house and stuff like if y'all only knew how hard it has been um for me to like physically get dressed and go to work these past couple of weeks but the only reason why i still have been doing it and pushing through is because it's been making me feel better like once i get to work and get around you know what i'm saying like my co-workers and stuff and just being out the house and not sitting in my thoughts sitting in my troubles like it's been good for me um and like you know just continuing to do stuff like as a family as a couple whatever the case but like i feel like i'm just rambling right now but i'm saying all this to say like I'm just going to try my best to just continue to record and document my life because that's what it is. And like I had uh, one of my subscribers write me on Instagram like we was DMing and she was basically telling me like, you know, I'm a single mom of two and you don't understand how. Woo, child I'm about to cry. She was saying like, you don't understand how just your personality and seeing you you know is like encouragement or um you know what i'm saying like that shit keep her going and it's crazy that 
me just being myself and showing myself does that for people you know what i'm saying because i mean she she told me that but i'm pretty sure out of my other 515 subscribers like i'm sure there are other people who feel the same way and it's crazy that in the midst of me struggling literally like i can be encouragement to other people so then i also seen a tiktok too just now when i was sitting in there and it was basically like um being a content creator or influencer is like you know people want to do it for the wrong reasons like don't do it because you want to be popular like do it because you want to you know show how god is is working in your life or you know what i'm saying like you want to be encouragement and i just thought about it like all my life i've always been the type of person like to you know what i'm saying like i want to share my knowledge i want to share my you know like i've always 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 been an open book like it's been periods of my time where i was very personal or private about things that were going on in my life but for the most part i was very open and, up and upfront like my very very first youtube video ever was telling my miscarriage story so like i just always been an open person and just wanting to share and i was think when i seen that tiktok i'm just thinking like dang that's true like nowadays a lot of people want to do it because it's trendy it's cool it's cute but like when you really can make a difference in someone else's life that you don't know like that's really what it's about you know what i'm saying like i'm not really a materialistic person i don't like all the you know oh all the like having money and luxuries and that's fine you know to have luxuries that you know are physical or tangible like bags or whatever case cars but a luxury to me personally is being able to spend time with my man and my kids and you know what i'm saying like to live like to go on a family trip to do things like you know what i'm saying it's a luxury for me to be able to to you know just give to people in the way that i do and so like that's why my bio says this shit is just authentic like i've never and you know what i'm saying like i like clothes and shoes and i like that stuff and getting dressed and i really do need to get more into that um because i do like those things and that would be me you know what i'm saying focusing on myself in that way but like at the same time like i've always been a real super down to earth girl like never been no stuck up bitch like just never been that person and like i don't know it means i'm saying i'm just gonna say it means a lot more to me to have some kind of effect or some kind of influence or not even influence i don't want to use that word or some kind of like positive effect on people on y'all you know what i'm saying who watching my channel like i'm sure it's just some nosy people that just be watching my channel sometimes but that's none of my business um but yeah i said all that to say i'm gonna keep recording and you know what i'm saying documenting like i can't promise consistency right now but i'm gonna try and like i told y'all in the last video i already know this shit finna go up for me not for monetary purposes or anything else like of course everybody wants money but at the same time like when i think about being successful or living a luxury life or whatever the case like that's me making money in my sleep you know what i'm saying that's me being able to do things with my family my kids my man or whatever the case and not have to worry about bills not have to worry about you know what i'm saying like being successful to me means being like truly happy and peaceful inside and so like this shit finna go up for me and i'm not just talking about youtube i'm talking about my life period like bro when i tell y'all this has been a very 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 hard time for me but i already know something is finna come from this because like i've never been this low in my life and the other times in my life when i was low only good came from it so yeah my mouth is dry now i didn't talk too much i already told you i was hungry but yeah so thank y'all for you know always supporting me and holding it down you know what i'm saying and yeah Bow leg itself.
Hey, loyal. Slow down. You, you might fall, so slow down. You might. 2020 vision. City girls leaning. Capping us bow shit. Beach, we tweeting. Yes. What you say, Brian? Come on. Come on. Come on. What you had said? <laughs> <laughs> y'all i look a mess look at my hair anyway we are about to go get a carpet cleaner miles is doing the most jumping his truck with my truck but we're about to go get a carpet cleaner so that we can get the house. What in the world? Prepared for the weekend. Y'all, it was so many people invited to our house woman. It's gonna be like, 50, it's 50 plus people. Oh. As I was saying before he slammed the hood and made me drop my phone, it was 50 plus people invited. And you know, people be bringing people. So, we gotta get the house prepared. This is my only day off until Saturday. The event is Saturday, so we have to get stuff, you know, together and ready. And I'm really, really excited, y'all. So, <clears throat> I'm gonna tell y'all this. I, um, I might be getting proposed to. If I'm not getting proposed to, y'all won't see this part of the video because I'm going to take it out. But, y'all, I might be getting proposed to. And I say that because, first of all, for months, I've been saying it. Y'all remember the last time I had on this hoodie and I had a ponytail. And I was like, y'all, I got to tell y'all something one day. Just remember it, da da da, da. I was going to make one of those, I think I'm going to get proposed to videos on TikTok. But now that the time is closer, I can go ahead and say it. I think I'm going to get proposed to. If I don't, it's cool. But I already know for a fact, actually, because he told me. But I just don't know if he's still going to do it because he told me. We had gotten to, like, a really big argument. And he was like, I was trying to make sure I had a ring, da 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 So in my head, I'm thinking, like, he just saying that because we've been into it. You know what I'm saying? And going through shit, like, so he's trying to. You know do that you like it if you think i'm lying ask your mama so me and my mama ended up talking about it and but well, we ain't really talked that much about it but i asked her and she was like yeah like he had been asking months ago so then he finally told me like yeah i asked your mom back in november and so i don't know if he's still gonna do it how me and miles we probably need to get in the boxing ring and fight each other. <laughs> but anyway, um, at the same time, I don't know for sure if we're getting engaged. Because like I said, he told me. And why would he tell me? But at this point, I think he might just wait until a later time. But I think all his friends and stuff know. That's one of the reasons why, before he even told me, I been felt it coming. Because... Um, my hands ashy i've been felt it coming because everybody was just acting weird like he was asking me about the housewarming he was like um like a month and a half ago he was like um i said something about getting my hair done and i was like but you know worst case scenario if i don't get my hair done i just um you know wash my hair and wear my own hair he was like nah you need to get your hair done because people gonna be taking pictures and stuff and i'm like what the fuck is people gonna be taking pictures of like my hair will be done it just won't be no weave he was like no nah, just you need to get your hair done so then one of our friends kept asking me like she was like girl what you wearing she was like yeah, you need to stand out and, da, da, da. and i'm like i called her one day actually and i'm like listen am i gonna get proposed to she like i don't know and i don't know stuff had just had been weird and then on top of that like back in the summer miles had like posted some stuff on facebook or like i would catch him saying stuff here or there 
And I was like, bro, this man finna try to propose to me. And I knew the housewarming would be the perfect time because all of my family would be here or whatever. And so I just kept thinking, you know, whatever. So then when we got into the argument, I've been telling y'all this story for a long time, four minutes. But anyway, when we got into the argument, he like, yeah. And, you know, I was trying to make sure I had my stuff straight so that I could do this, da, da, da. So like I said, I don't know if he's still gonna do it. If he don't, I'm not gonna be mad because, you know, when he first started planning it, we were at a good space. Right now, we're at a good space too, but you know, we working through some things. And so maybe it's just not the right time to do it right now. But we'll see y'all. But anyway, said all that to say, I'm getting my hair done. I'm getting my nails done. Look at my hands. I still don't know what I'm wearing. I need to go get me an outfit. They gave me some lashes. I was looking back at some pictures from when we went to LA because before I had my hair done for my birthday, but before my birthday, that was the last time I had my hair done was in March of last year. And it's gonna be March again. But we had went to LA and I had my hair done and yeah, I was just a bad bitch. So I need to get myself back to her. You know what I'm saying? Like get myself back to that point like when me and miles first met i was in my bag y'all like i was in my bag like like for real for real i still had goals and stuff that i wanted to reach but like i was still on my shit i was working at the club so i was making money and you know i was saving money like i just i just was in my bag but i love loyal to death but when i got pregnant everything just stopped like everything just stopped but anyway that's 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 neither here nor there because my boy is gonna be one years old and mama's back okay but anyway i'm gonna call y'all back when we get um done with our errands i'm gonna take y'all with me to do the errands obviously we about to go get a um carpet cleaner so that we can clean the carpet then like we held out on this housewarming so that we could get stuff done like when we bought this house it had like 10 different color paints on the wall in the house like it's no bullshit it's like 10 different colors in the house so we wanted to do that i wanted to redo the kitchen like we just had plans to do all this stuff and then life happened so we didn't get to do that however we're still just gonna go ahead and celebrate and just you know do our thing all right, bye, y'all. Of course, it wouldn't be like us if we didn't stop and get food before we do anything. Oh, thank you, gentlemen. Thank you so much. <laughs> Y'all, this dog just came in our yard. Look at them babies in her stomach. Oh my God. Girl, ain't nobody finna do nothing to you. I don't give a damn. She shouldn't have had her dog. What? So I'm trying to find me some press ons because this is not gonna cut it. But really, I mean, these nails are shaped cute, but I don't like the color. I might be able to finesse these. I don't know. I don't know, this color, no, this color not gonna look good on me. I'm, I'm gonna look like an old lady. I probably do need to get these ones. Or maybe these ones. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm wearing. And I'm in here trying to pick out nails. Oh, y'all, this is what I love about this time of year, Valentine's Day. They got all the pinks and reds. Oh, it's so pretty. And this little heart bag. Okay, this is kind of cute. Oh, these are so cute. Oh my God, these are cute. I will get these. 
No, I wouldn't actually. I forgot I wear a size 10 in Forever 21 shoes, so they would look crazy on me. But these is cute as hell. One of y'all come get these shoes. You want to try it on? All right, let's see. You shit it right now, though. I'm about to say, don't try it on right now. Oh, damn, damn boy. Calm down. Y'all, yeah, this is Loyal's birthday outfit. You like it? Do you like it? Oh, no. Okay. Y'all, I'm so annoyed. Why is my part all the way? Every time I try to like get my hair done, it just don't turn out like, I don't know. Now I gotta try to go home and figure out how to fix my hair. I look like somebody's fucking grandma. All right, y'all, so I had to cut like two pieces out because I don't know she just had it way too deep I ain't like that and I'm probably going to go through and curl it a little bit more before the party actually start but this is the oh, best it's going to get we're going to get Journey together too that's okay so do I <coughs> but we about to finish getting everything set up so, well, I'll let y'all know when, when, when guests start coming. So, now, I'm on another run to Party City. Y'all, I've been telling y'all for the while, for the while, for the longest. <laughs> I do not like going to the store. I don't like shopping. I don't like stuff like that. Like, and I'm just so aggravated because... I don't understand why I'm the one being sent to the store. I got to fix my hair. I try to fix my hair a little bit. I'm never going back to that girl ever again. And then, like, she didn't even ask me. Oh, look at me. She didn't She didn't even ask me if, like, I don't know. She didn't. We didn't talk the whole time. It was so awkward. Like, dang, is y'all going to hit me or what? But anyway, we are about to go in party city and i'm gonna park right here in this curbside parking i don't care because we're gonna be in and out okay the line doesn't look long so that's great that's fine we curbside <laughs> put it under the seat that was like two minutes now we out we got everything that we needed great oh my mom calling My glam squad. Say hey, y'all. <laughs> Key. Book with her. She do hair, nails, lashes, toes, interior design. She does it all. Period. Loyal. He's like, what in the world? Happy birthday, Loyal. Loyal. Hey. Put him right there and pop it on. Oh, yeah. Hey. He trying to kiss Fred. Loyal. Loyal. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. 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 Oh, damn, I'm stuff over. 
this nigga off home. That's what I want to do. I hate to go to Riverdale. I went more definitely ain't going nowhere, Blackhead. What? Oh, you ain't going nowhere. I'm going to go. Are you going to go to Cooter, huh? I know where I'm going to go. So, Thank you. I got to drop you off or what? No, you ain't got to drop shit off. I know where I'm going to go. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I ain't going nowhere. Vito roll with. Ooh, I'm, ooh, thank God that's not our responsibility. Vito <laughs> drone. I'm laughing at your husband in this fucking. Why am I in a grocery store <clears throat> at 7 45 in the morning to get baby from the group? We didn't get home till 4 o'clock, y'all. I'm so tired. Look at my hair. Ugh. I'm glad my baby don't have to drink like formula milk no more. Next thing is these damn diapers. Hey, hey y'all. Hey, Angie. I have seen you so long. How are you? How are you? Good. If I would have known we was having a party, I would have did my hair. You too. I got cake in it from yesterday. Hey, Annie. Thank you. Oh, it's okay. you. I know this is right. You said he look like who? Oh, okay. Oh, that's Miles. Y'all know Miles. Miles, this is everybody. Uh-huh. We ain't going down a little like that. That's how you got in the predicament you in now, being bent over. <laughs> See Maya man? Oh, uh uh. What the hell is going on? Wanna do the dark game with Brian and I? You can line up just so that way everybody has a chance, and we not just the only ones throwing the darts. Cause we got Zoom watchers who watching. So if you wanna line up? She's so excited. She is so excited. Come on, I use some good dartboard, and so. Uh, I think it's five of what the gender is. So you're going to see both colors. But whatever the most color that you see at the end, that's what it is. So we'll see. Oh. He's talking about oh. scoreboard over there. Yeah. 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 Oh, he's talking about he's been the shooter. <laughs> Okay, that was one pink. He got a few of them. But only one pop and one was pink. So But if they still pink, I mean, still pink. Hold on, Celeste. You can go next. You got a boy. And one there. I'm going to go girl. Okay, okay. You team girl? You team girl? Oh, we know that. Uh-huh. Hold on, Celine. Oh, that was both. Huh? That look like Bo. What's that, Bo? I knew you wanted a boy, didn't you? Celine, back up. Wow. Why you look like that? You tired? Today is day one in the gym. I said, come on, three times. And he's scrolling on TikTok. <laughs> I'm excited. Are you excited? He don't sound too excited to me. But anyway... My hair is messed up, but it's going to be even worse when I leave out of here. I probably should have wore a scarf or something.
You ready? He probably called cause he was she two. Yeah, she probably called her man. He was two of the man. She called him. Y'all, it was two different FedEx drivers, right? They boyfriend and girlfriend. Oh, now her boyfriend get. Oh wait, they just put him in the truck just to calm him down. I mean, in the car just to calm him down. Y'all, the the damn woman right here with the shortcut. She was finna fight a man, and her nigga is a FedEx driver. Y'all can't see his car cause it's on the other side, but he pulled up. And the nigga pulled off. She said he put the gun in her face. <gasps> oh, so he really did do something. I'm Loyal, don't hit him. Stop. <laughs> Say good morning. Oh. Y'all look at this man in this childish helmet. It's that's not even your helmet. This is just a cover for the helmet, right? There's a yeah. cover for the helmet. Keep his head warm. To keep his head warm. Mm -hmm. no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So the weekend is over. I'm at work right now. I'm about to go in Duncan and get me some coffee. Um I had a great weekend overall. Um, I was so happy to see my family and everybody. Um, as y'all see, we went out. Hold on. There was a lot of people in Duncan just now. That's why I stopped recording. And I told y'all I would never tell y'all where I work, but whatever. I work at Verizon. Um, yeah, so I had a great weekend overall. I had so much fun. I decided because one of my TikTok friends was going to let me make her some lashes. Since I still don't have anybody to practice on. Y'all ever had hash browns from Duncan? They all right. I had to put some hot sauce on them. But anyway, as always, thank y'all for watching. I'm trying to think what else I vlogged this whole time. Miles procedure went well. Everything was great. And one last thing. I'm starting my fitness journey. So y'all gonna see me doing a whole lot of working out and clean eating. Last night for dinner, I had salmon, rice, avocado. Yeah, salmon, rice, avocado. And I had a protein shake. Well, I made a protein shake this morning. I haven't eaten it yet. I'm gonna eat that as my snack. And I had oatmeal and orange for breakfast. So yeah, y'all, Um, make sure y'all stay on me with my fitness stuff, okay? Corvette, Corvette, hopping them up, jet like that. Oh.